What's up guys, my name's Collins Newey. Post Up is my stream and I'm thrilled to be bringing you guys the 2024 US Open Championships out of Griff's Bar and Billiards. We're gonna be bringing you US Open 10 ball, US Open 8 ball, US Open bank pool, and US Open one pocket straight through every day till March 16th. We're bringing it to you live from Griff's Bar and Billiards right here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Hey, I just wanna let you guys know, I don't treat my stream like a typical pool stream. I don't treat it like that sports broadcast model. I treat it like I'm hanging out with you guys at home in the chat, super interactive, fun, lighthearted. We get down and we have a good time. The best part is, if you don't like that style, you can just hit the mute button and enjoy some of the best pool in the world. It's basically a who's who of the best players from around the world. Either way, come check it out and let's have some fun. Who won between me and Melina Mike last night? We actually didn't end up playing. I ended up editing videos until like 1 a.m. Shocked. I, I'm scared. I'm scared. Yeah. That's what it is. Here comes the line. I'm waiting for it. I'm scared. I'm waiting for it. Here we go. Come on. I, know, I, I know you got something. No, I don't got nothing. Something behind the I'm curtain. I'm serious. I'm scared of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're a scary guy. Okay, here yeah. we go, guys. Let's go. Ooh, we got to get on the right thing. Time for the lag. Race to 13. This is one set. One set. And Shane is going to win the lag. And I'm going to get the scoreboard right. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Dogging it. I'll change the race length and everything, too. We are racing to 13, guys. Monster break out the gate, but doesn't get an open shot on the one. The results of the poll. A thousand and one people, 90% in favor of Shane Van, Van Boning in this match. Nice save from Shane. Little containing shot there. He's going to have a two rail kick at the one. Someone in the chat just said there's no sound on Griff's TV right now at the moment. I don't know how to help you if you can't hear me say, turn off the mute. <laughs> You're muted right now. Wow. Colin's coming in with the heat, son. <laughs> Jeez. Look at this safe by Shane. Real nice. Real nice. Tough to get safe off the kick. You're, all, you're actually kicking to make the ball, I think. Oh, yeah, 100%. Kicking to make the ball. 100%. You have to, right? I mean, what? Yeah, yeah. yeah. If you yeah. don't make the ball here, you probably sell out. Right. Yeah. He yeah, lays pretty good. You know, it's a common one pocket shot that you'll see come up quite a bit. He's a very particular player, so I mean, I'm sure he's, you know, he'll he'll line himself up and. Oh, just missed it. Wow, was not off by very much. And Shane Van Boning is going to get ball in hand. <clears throat> Over under on the run out time here? Oh, I'm going to tell you what. Minute 45? This guy's got place to be and things to do. Minute so, 45. Yeah. Probably. Shane has been playing some real fast I'm, pool I'm not going to mention any names, but me, well, so me and Spencer were betting on some over-unders on, on length of run out at the Rio during the 10 ball. Yeah. Right? And at a certain point, it got all the way up to like 12 and a half minutes. <laughs> a rack of 10 ball. 
with without multiple innings with one inning no like well, one no no guy no. To the table? no 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 of course it oh, was okay, it okay, was okay, like okay. just to run the rack out in general gotcha so and it was a combination of what the breaks were like what the layouts were after the break and then the players that were playing so touchy draw shot here it is Not unless you're SVB. Shane Ben Boeing yep yeah cue ball on a string man I know there's someone in the chat that's timing it too. There's someone in the chat that's timing this. Gets back to the good side of the eight. Yeah, he's fine here. And looking real good. I'm surprised Shane stuck in the booth as long as he did with you because he's like a workhorse. He likes to stay in rhythm, stay hitting I, balls. Honestly, and I, Mike, I think he was having fun. No, no, no. I Let me tell you, I know he was because as soon as he left, yeah. he had a smile on his face. And if you know Shane, yeah. Shane is – I mean, don't get me wrong. He's not like a miserable guy. He's, he's, no, no, he's, no. He's, he's very much – but like – He's he, kind of stoic and just he introverted, was, you know? He was enjoying himself 100%. Yeah, that's really cool. So – Kudos to you for, for doing that. No, not to me. I mean, kudos to him in the chat, man. It was the chemistry there that uh, that made it fun, I think. So you guys are the best. Well, the interaction is great. But, you know, I like I told you before, whenever we first got in here, I said just keep it kind of short because I know Shane likes to practice. And so after, like, the 10-minute mark, I was like, uh, it should be all right since he's not walking out yet. So, <laughs> um, but... It looks like he's he's feeling pretty good about himself and and hitting the ball real well. The chat said it was a minute and thirty three twenty nine. Oh, nice! Minute I see. I would have taken the over. You would have taken the over. I would have taken the over. I yeah, told yeah. you the line was good yeah. right there. I, I would have taken, taken the, the over. Yeah. I would have taken the under. No. He's just running the ball so fast now. Mm -hmm. He's ready. I'm gonna post the Griff's link on Windows Open because I, I think people still don't know. Yeah, do it. Oh, I'll put it on post on post stuff as well. Yeah, on Facebook. If you do, let me know. Yeah, I'll figure it out. Someone gunning for a Nike sponsorship? I think the guy's just trying to stay comfortable. Pretty good break, except the one ball ends up on the short rail. It looks, it seems to be for a lot of Vitaly's breaks, he ends up being forced in a position where he has to move, make a move, you know. But for the ones where he has a shot on the one, it's like, it looks absolutely choice. Yeah, very much. You know, and that's why, like, even though Shane's got a really big break, it, it was, it's not as controlled as Vitalis has been, at least from last night. Obviously, we haven't seen it today, but Vitali was controlling that one ball, like, in the upper corner consistently. How much for first and second? There you go, guys. The payouts. Put a dead center table. Just leave it right here. What do you think, guys? No? Don't like it? No takers? Okay. Put it back, please put it back. <laughs> What's that? I had the payouts right over the entire table, like covering the table. <laughs> I 
Ah, the Easton's joining the party here. You want me to get Savannah in here? No, I like I like this. I, I, really, it's a good vibe. All right, buddy, I'm yeah. good with it. Whenever whenever I need a breakout. Yeah, I'm are you out, just trying I'm... to get out? Do I stink? It's those shorts are making me real uncomfortable. I hate to bring it up again, but yeah. it's just I need like an HR department. Anyway, jump shot here. Airborne. Two ball tries to reverse back into the pocket that he called. I think he's going to get away with it. He's going to be all right. Maybe a little bank. Does, he got, here. does he got a bank? Oh, yeah, he does. Right? Maybe a little bank orang. You can shorten it up pretty good. Actually, he has to lengthen it out, I think. If he can see it. Might not be able to see it. the right side of the two putting the two ball, the cue ball on the other side of the 10 I like that shot play conservative oh he played the, and look at that he played the yeah, two ball he speed that good. He, he played the speed of the two ball there to the back side of the four this is awkward this is really awkward thing you gotta come he's looking to come off the right side of it but that, that corner pocket if you hit a bat is just Big. Hey, Thomas <laughs> Heller, thanks for the thanks for the support on Venmo, man. Appreciate it. Amanda's been watching a lot of the stream. Yeah. Yeah. And the wife. Yeah. Nice. She enjoying it? Yeah, she said she was talking about Shane. Oh, I thought she okay. Yeah. SVB. She called him SVB. Oh, she is learning the Yeah, she's getting the the lingo. Oh no, she's getting hooked, guys. She might be hanging out of the pool hall coming up here in a couple weeks. Okay, relax, cowboy. <laughs> I'm getting excited. All right. You know what else I'm excited about? Seeing what Shane's gonna do right here. Is he gonna kick on the back side of the two? Use the four to slow the two ball down and hopefully Get some separation, maybe. Hits the two thin, misses the entire four, so the two ball doesn't stay where it was. Is the five ball in between? It's a little, uh... A little dicey. Yeah, a little bit. Just a little this bit. This is a little dicey. Hey, same thing for Traver Travis Richardson. Thank you as well, man. He's looking at this one pretty good. And I can't say that I blame him. He got like a right in a funky little spot here. I wonder if he's just playing to make it. Wow. What you know how tough that is to do? That is a ridiculous wow. shot. The difficulty in hitting the ball that good with that speed Guys, from that, that distance. Guys, that shot looks so much easier than it is because he hit it perfect. But go ahead and try it at home. It's all about that line, and then you have to hold it. You have to hit it perfect, and then you have to... Get a little fortunate there. That was an excellent honestly, shot from Vitaly. Honestly, one of the only, one of the few people in this game right now that hits hits shots like that that good fairly frequently is a guy at the table right now. SVB is is fantastic at doing stuff like that as well, controlling both balls and knowing exactly. Really, how I was thinking things. like a little Federer esque there, you know, just keeping it simple, but really high level shot. Oh, Ooh, baby, extracting ball in hand. Wow. Fantastic shot from Vitaly. 
All right. He runs to the table for ball in hand. I gotta go do some work for just a little bit, but I shall return. Okay. Right. Vitaly going to take his time here trying to make sure that he converts this to a win. These first opening sequence here, two, three, four, five, is the whole kit and caboodle of this rack. Next two shots are key. Yeah, Shane was trying to hit that ball thin. I see someone in the chat pointing that out. He was trying to hit that ball thin so that he can get some separation between the, the two and the cue ball, but the gamble doesn't work out. Hit it so thin he forgot to hit it, I know. Brutal. Interesting spot here because the eight ball sits so high up on this uh, long rail here. I actually like the, the back and forth. Instead of the three rail, because the three rail here, I think, wants to be coming across here. See that? Gives you, like, a, a steeper angle a lot of the time, but he actually found a, a really nice line into the third rail, so, so it was coming off of a higher point on the third rail. That was a nice shot. I think the natural position there, like the natural, was coming a little bit lower for a steeper angle on the eight, but Vitaly negotiated it really well. The other way, it's like a stun shot, and it just keeps you higher up on the table. It's just a personal preference, though. There's some guys that would shoot it one way, and some guys shoot it the other. One to one. One to one, kicking things off in this race to 13. The little accordion music coming through. <laughs> Gotta like it. Next. Uh, Q Baller says, this commentator is clueless. I am not a commentator. I'm a streamer. I'm hanging out with you guys and trying to... Trying to share some opinions when I... When I can but I am definitely no pro. That's what Jeremy Jones and Alex Laley and all them guys are for. If you can do a better job, you're more than welcome to come down. I'll have you hang out in the booth. Just fly on out to Vegas. <laughs> right, Armson. <laughs> I I just I just roast him a little bit because I think it's it's just a little silly to I think he's being silly. Anyway. 
We keep it. We keep it fun. We keep it fun, guys. Shane Van Boning, massive break. And how often does Shane? How many times is that now that Shane has broken the balls? Just in the last three days, that we've seen Shane break the balls in the one ball come up here. I think at least three or four. Maybe f this is the fifth time that the one ball has ended up right here for a bank shot as his opening shot, and he just gins it in the side pocket and runs out. Relax, guys. Relax. We're just playing. Nice, nice, nice. Shane just makes this game so freaking easy, dude. Eight ball sitting right in front of the corner. So easy to slide up to the nine. Oh, this is real nice, too. Just... Just so easy. Yeah, Raffer B says, I hate how easy he makes it look. It ruins my game. Every time I watch Shane play, it makes me feel like I could go out and run a four-pack right now. Focus. Focus. There it is. SVB. Two to one. <laughs> Shane would be on the hill if it was winter break. Yeah. It's a single race to 13 in the finals, guys. Modified double elimination. All right, what do we got, buddy? Is this the right score? 2-1? Two, 2-1, one? Two one, yeah. Sweet. Rance from the Sofa says... I can't tell if this is sarcasm or not. The, the thing I like about the pro commentators is listening to them say how they think the player is going to play the shot, followed by, uh, well, yeah, you could play it that way, too. <laughs> My favorite thing watching pool streams is when somebody gets out of line, you know, just a little out of line. Oh, oh, you overran the cue ball here. And then they say, but he's okay. Because yeah. it's Shane yeah. Van Boning or like because it's Nika Imminen or like, you know what I mean? Well, they just the, the being able to adjust. Yeah. You know, a little scratch on the break from Vitaly in a. Uh, really big moment, frankly, in the beginning of this set. It's really important when you're playing a guy like SVB to fire back. When he's launching missiles at you and you don't shoot back, it's a recipe for disaster. Yeah. I mean, no, we all know how imposing that he can be and not just with his run out, but with his break, you know. And so if he gets this, if he gets everything dialed in like he's able to, he's already a little funny here. Um, yeah, look out. You don't want to get in too well, deep can... of a hole, especially on alternate break. Yeah. I, I like drawing the ball back here because you could draw short and shoot the three in the corner. If you get to here, you can shoot the three in the side. And if you get to here, you can shoot the three in this corner. Shane's rolling the ball out two rails to get back to the side pocket. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Nice a little close down. to your work here. Michael Aldaffer says this is like sitting in the game room watching with a bunch of buds. That's what we try to do. That is the vibe, the intended vibe. I don't know about you guys, but my favorite part about going to the pool room, aside from playing the game myself, when I'm done playing the game myself and I want to go sweat some other action, I like sitting on the rail and talking to the boys. You know what I mean?
Whoa, close again. Close again. <laughs> uh, happy Edens, my name is Collins Nui. Dude, Billy Burgess, thanks for the love on PayPal. Super generous, man. Thank you. Justin Folks, thank you as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. As well as David Baranski. You guys are the best. Plays the four ball, no problem. And this rack. I'm gonna go to SVB. Look at the focus, Shane, just like, yep, that's what I'm gonna do. And I'm gonna walk up, rack the balls, and do it again. It's like we have a match with Payne McBride right now. I don't recognize the guy he's playing. Carlo Biato on the rail again. Oh, that's Cena. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He had a big uh, tournament at the Swanee. One ball's going to find the corner. How many balls does Shane want to make on the break? Look, the two balls setting up straight in. And time for Shane with another seven ball run out going to be done in about a minute and a half. Oh, my break. I, I don't know. I don't know how he lost in any of the 10 ball events out there in Vegas. I mean, in Vegas, we're here in Vegas right now, but at the Rio. Uh, with the template. With the template, rack your own. I don't know who's going to beat Shane right now. Holy crap. Uh, 13, Isander, thank you for the compliment. I mean, it is the final, so only Vitaly has the chance. <laughs> yeah. Truth. Uh, someone, Joseph Gabriel says, Collins, don't jinx him. I, I genuinely believe that's impossible. Uh, the way that Shane's playing right now, it's something to watch. Something to witness. SVB with a quick lead of 4-1, to one, punishing the scratch on the break that happened less than five minutes ago by Vitaly Patsura with running that rack out and break and running another one immediately. A minute and 10 seconds? Casey Looper says a minute 42. The pace of play is cranked up. We've turned the pace of play up to 11 with SVB. Uh, 
Uh, Vitaly cannot afford another scratch on the break. How cool would it be to get an hour of coaching from SVB? Life in Buick says, you know, if you're the right person, I'm not, how do you say this? This isn't, uh, this is intended to just be like a factual statement, you know, because coaches, it's important to find a coach that has like a good uh, personality matchup with you and a good, uh, like you communicate in a similar way for you to get the most out of your coach. And I think most people in the chat can understand what I'm saying there. If you have a, a, the right uh, personality and, and uh, way of communicating to jive with Shane Van Boning, it, it's probably priceless. Now with Vitaly's break, things not working. Struggle bus early days for Vitaly Petsura. Really, really appreciate all the love, you guys. I'm glad you're having a fun time. Vitaly trying to put the cue ball behind the two. Doesn't get there. Doesn't really tie up the two ball either. Uh, not that that necessarily matters at the moment with where the one ball's sitting. I don't think uh, there's really any, any true offensive option here. For Shane, unless he comes with something real creative with the nine ball hanging in the side. But that's a pure gamble. Because if you catch it thin, you can't really control the ball that you're hitting it with. So he's looking at the line to send the cue ball between the eight and two, or at least in that direction, off the second rail. So trying to find that spot. <laughs> Chetty Moonlight says, I spent an hour getting lessons from Buddy Hall in the 90s. It didn't help. Well, maybe maybe there just wasn't the right vibe. He could also just do the tried and true shot of, of putting splitting the cue ball and the one with the three, but he finds that perfect line. Look exactly where he pointed. Vitaly's going to be jumping here. No doubt in my mind, Vitaly's jumping here. Position is probably on offer with the jump cue as well. He calls the corner pocket. Uh, Sarah, because I am, asks, where is the next broadcast? We're just going to go right back live on... We're going to keep this one rolling straight through. And then we're going to go right back live on YouTube and Facebook with uh, with Post Up to continue the U.S. Open 8-Ball Championship. Marshall Maynard says, foul shot coming. I don't think he's going to foul, but whether he makes the one is the question doesn't quite get there and he's going to leave an opening for Shane and Shane breaks the next game uh Leslie Webb asks Collins what's your Fargo uh easy to find on Fargo rate my name is Collins Newey I'm the only one on the internet but uh if you're curious I've uh been as high as 612 and as low as 589 right now um maybe 588 I haven't been playing much pool since I've been doing the streaming thing. Sorry, buddy. Yo. Okay. Pull down those shorts a little bit. No, this is comfortable. Okay. All right, what do we got going on, man? 4-1? Four, 4-1, one. Four, one, Shane Van Boning. Doing uh, Shane Van so, Boning so, things, so huh? So Vitaly scratched on the break Kay. two games ago. All right. So Shane runs that rack out and then breaks and runs the next rack in about a minute, minute and a half. 
Vitali breaks. What a bully, man. Doesn't get a shot on the one ball. And then Shane plays. They, they go back and forth for two innings. And uh, and Vitali sells out after a jump shot that Shane left him, you know, safe. And Vitali was forcing to jump to try to make the one. But now Shane's running out again. And if history tells us anything, he's probably going to break and run the next rack. He's got this table dialed unless he gets a funky kiss. Yeah, I was heading out of the booth and got stopped like 18 different times, including by one of our sponsors of the event, the uh, gentleman who did the flyer for us, Chris Santana Chris of here. Fast and Loose Designs. He nice. wants to meet you, buddy. Nice. Can't wait. Yeah. He heard you're a fish. And, I am. Um, I'm definitely a fish. So if you guys need any work done when it comes to logos or flyers or any of that good stuff, make sure and hit him up. He does phenomenal work. I cannot vouch for his uh, professionalism and uh attention to detail enough man he's yeah. he's outstanding fast and loose designs big shout out to, to chris santana he's gonna try to hold it here his line has to be good because not a lot of room for error if he just tries to come out one rail a little touchy just like that and he yeah, hit it great yeah totally he hit dialed, it great dude there's just no stopping this guy what a jerk man just, you, you have just to execute so good. on your brakes you have to get there on your brakes or you got to just pray Yep. the pool gods are going to jump in and, and you know, well, stop the madness. There's very few guys who can fight the pool gods one-on-one. -on -one yeah, like that, pull out the fists. Yeah, and that guy right there, he's one of them. Yeah, use that use that uh, pool glove as a boxing glove. Yeah, don't worry about it, Danny. It's only the final going on, buddy. Yeah, it's fine. It's all right. It's all right. Five. One oh and my God! Breaking. Five, one, and breaking. What a performance! He sent that thing. Gladly. Oh man, this is the best thing I've ever is seen. Is that Colin. Jennifer Rabbit? It is. Of course it is. It is. Jennifer Rabbit just sent me the best, the best thing ever. Colin's got a photo of it. Let's see if he posts it on. Oh, I'm not posting it. I know you will. Come on, don't make me don't make me out to be the bad guy here. What do you mean me make you out to be the bad guy? You're the bad guy. No. No. <laughs> no. You're being a bad guy. No. All right, let's see. Five one by you update the score? Of course I do. Yeah? Okay. Alright, good deal. Why are they playing on the nearby table? They're in the tournament, Dustin Morris. Yeah, so we got the U.S. Open 8-Ball Championships going on right now in the first round as well. Look at this break, man. Look at this. Yeah, He's going to get a shot on the side. Also, and... if, you, if you were watching during the last match that we watched on stream and Shane was in the booth, Shane really doesn't care. He really, like, doesn't, like, he talked about the guy rolling through. Mr. Oh, you asked him about they it? They see me right Oh, in. yeah. Yeah, I asked him about it. He says, oh, I don't care. Even if they want to talk to me, I don't care. Oh, he's a professional, man. Yeah. He's been through it enough. Yeah. He's just going to play some pool, you know? He's just going to do his thing. And uh, by the way, Shane just absolutely crushes him, gets a shot straight in the side. <laughs> and the rack, I mean, this rack's over too, dude. It's a wrap, son. Yeah, it's getting real. It's gonna get out of hand here pretty soon. If real quick, yeah. If you know, if he can't stop the bleeding any. Dude does not waste any time. He's got places to be and things to do. And all Vitaly can do is just sit back. He ain't even watching. He's watching some somewhere else. I know. It's like he, it's like they're not even playing the same game, man. Yep. It's like they're not even playing the same game. Well, like people forget. I mean, listen, Shane's Mr. Shane's Mr. Nine Ball right now, but he was he, always Mr. He ten was ball Mr. Before. Ten Ball for the longest time. Yeah. You know and. This is the reason why. This is what he can do. 
This is why nobody wanted any piece of him gambling, playing big table 10 ball. You know, I remember one of the first big matches I went to was him and Dennis um, out in Virginia, and it was dubbed like the greatest 10 ball match on earth, and Shane just hammered him by like 40 games or something, yeah. you know? Vitaly's going to step away for a moment. Things haven't been working for him, and he's just getting absolutely obliterated early days in this set, so can't blame the guy for wanting to step away and cool off, maybe. Reset, hit that reset button. You gotta hit some kind of button. Yeah. All right. All around the room, you got champions all over. I'm I'm looking through the window here. We got FSR just hanging out. He just got done playing on the TV table. You guys can check out Post Up, YouTube, and Facebook. Make sure and go hit the follow button on there. We're gonna be streaming all the matches outside of the finals on there. You're talking about. You're talking about windows open. No, I said Post Up. You said outside of the finals? Oh, oh, I see yeah, what you're yeah. saying. Yeah, 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 yeah. In, in every tournament leading right. up to the finals. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, um, on Windows Open, I do got a match stream right now. I think it's Feller versus Billy Thorpe. First round or second round eight ball. So if you guys want to check out some eight ball, you can go sweat that as well. Looks like Carlo Beato is streaming his match. If you want to check that on his YouTube channel. A lot of pool coming out of this room right now. Give a lot us of pool content. Big shout out to all of our sponsors. Michelle Griffin, Town, Diamond Billiard Products, Q-Tech, 1PKT. We will have some event shirts here on site. I think in the next day or two, I'll get some stuff here. Um, Premier Billiards are actually the all-around sponsor. Big shout out to them. We got some trophies for the all-around award we're going to be giving away. I'm going to add a couple mods in the chat, I guess, if people are getting out of hand. Uh, just some of the regs that I know. Um, if Griff wants to change it in the future, then that's that's fine. But uh, if people are getting out of hand, you can take care of it. I chat's going a little too fast for me right now, especially with the the heat of the action. Yeah, Stephen, I'll I'll unblock you on Windows Open, buddy. Just be cool is all I ask. Everybody, so. be cool. We're all just having fun. I don't like holding grudges, so life is too short. What what match is this, Collins? Uh, this looks like uh, Payne McBride and, and uh, Cena. Oh, man, dude, this guy. You know what? Look, here's the thing. I think I've, I pride myself on following pool and players from all over the world, right? And I had never, like, besides just on a scoreboard, Oops. I'd never seen this guy play before, ever. And then he just comes out here in Vegas and just starts doing some amazing things with, I think he was in the final of the Swanee. Dude plays solid, yeah, man. Yeah, plays I mean, just goal. solid. Oops. Here we go. We are back. Hey, Chris Knowles. Uh, my bad. I accidentally, I was trying to mod you and you, uh, I accidentally you got banned blocked. you. <laughs> so I just undid that. Good job, Collins. Yeah. Uh, undid that and now you, you got the mod, so. He did the same thing to me the other day. I posted the link of the bracket, and he was about to give me the boot, too. So don't feel <laughs> yeah. so bad. Yeah. All right, I think we should have enough people at least to take care of the, the riffraff. Man, you sound old. Five ball down. One ball is... Uh, the four ball got in the game of the one ball. Sometimes the pull guys just aren't on your side, man. Push out. 
Shane isn't isn't the guy you want to play chicken with though. So let's see what he left them. It looks like he left them a shot. See how good he's feeling. What happens when you're old, buddy? <laughs> good night. What do you think? I'll be right back, guys. I'll be hanging out with you guys. U.S. Open 10 ball championship final. Race to 13. Good return from Shane. One ball is really close to the rail, and with the new cloth, it really makes this shot just that much more touchy. We saw Vitaly play some really good, strong um, safety shots earlier, but you're going to have to come with something big. It looks like he wants to try to go right there between the 7 and 8 with the cue ball. I think the one ball is enough off the rail where he should be big favorite to put that ball there. But he's thinking. He's not afraid to take his time. And rightfully so. I mean, this is a big, big spot in the match. I mean, you're already down five racks, alternate break. You have to get this game here. He checked it up. Is it going to leave a window? He went all in, it looked like, on the bank. I don't even know if he called that. It looked like he was playing safe. And no, he did not call that. So I think Shane's going to get the option. He's pointing the finger. He says, you got it. I'm good. Which means he cannot see the two ball. And if you're by tally... When it rains, it pours. And what do you do here? I think he's going to try to go two rails at the two ball. He wants to hit right by where he's standing at. And that's what he's looking at, just trying to find his line. The problem is, you're going to have to hit it with some speed in order to get some separation. And it's going to be really difficult to not sell out a shot here. All right, let's see what he's got. One, two... Makes a good hit. I don't think he called that. Even if it were to go in, he's going to dress up right by the corner pocket. And he's a little annoyed. And I get it, man. Not not the start he's, he wants in this final. deep in there he wants that ball to slow up definitely did not want to play that now this is touchy and if you're Vitali, you just gotta hope you come back to the table Shane's looking to cut this ball He's having second thoughts. We hope you guys are enjoying the match to this point. He's calling the two rail. Kind of playing it two ways here. He's got blockers with the seven, eight ball just in case it does not go. I think he's right where he's pointing as where he wants to end up. Could be a swing, though. Vitaly hangs up a ball. Shane's supposed to get out. Vitaly's going to get a chance to get back to this table while Shane is digging up on this ball here just to kind of hold the cue ball on, the, on that side of the table. Did a good job here. 
Wow, and where it ended up, it just... It, very nice shot there from Shane. Well judged. see here he's lining up for another two rail kick I think he wants to hit this ball pretty full hitting it a little soft and he got the full part but he's not gonna like when he gets back to the table here because Shane is probably gonna bury him unless he elects to go for the run out I think he's going. And he is. And that ball's in. Nice shot from SVB. Captain America right in line on this four to come back for the seven, eight. Hit that one just a little thick, but he's perfect. Gonna draw right out. Put the eight ball in the same pocket. Looking to take a commanding seven game, six game lead. And if you're Vitality, you got to figure something out because it's not working. He's not liking something. I think he's just a little, a little flat, more flat than what he intended on being. Doesn't look like it passes the 10, so we may have to draw out of it. He's looking to see what his options are. I think he's considering rolling up. I think he can stun it on over just an, a little bit, but he's looking to roll forward. And he ain't messing around. He's taking his time here. Oh, wow. He got a lot of mileage out of that. Real nice shot there from Shane. Can just tell how comfortable he's feeling after all that he just decides to whip it around two rails beautiful shot there come over one and he's gonna get halfway home seven one svb and breaking See this big SVB break that he's had the entire tournament went undefeated through an unbelievable field. Yap, Fetter, Filler, FSR, Mario He, Albin Ocean, just some of the names that are that played in this event and we're down to the last two players. I think 63 players altogether entered in the US Open 10 ball championship. And you can see why one of them went undefeated. Shane's going to have a shot on the, in the side. Not the most controlled break, but it's been effective. And it's a four eights in a funny spot here. So he's going to have to address that at some point. Running into the two. And what's he going to do here? Now, if he can squeeze this by, you can 
make this shot real effective. You can open up the four ball here and just lay up on the eight. Just like that. But he wants it to move. Uh, he's good, though. He's really good. Didn't address the problem, but I think that's what he was trying to do. <laughs> Don't worry, Shane. Just move the ten ball. Put it wherever you want. Playing cue ball fouls only in this event. Vitaly's measuring up the two railer. He's had some really close matches this whole tournament, only dropping one set to Lee Van. I think something like 9 6, eight, something like that, 8 6. It was close. Comes back for revenge in the semifinals. Collins is coming back in here, you guys. As Vitaly's got to figure something out here. He's got to make contact. He's got to try to hide the cue ball some way. Or at a bare minimum, live the fight another day. Good shot. But what are you going to do? Yeah. What are you going to do? Yeah, you know, when you're spinning your wheels a little bit, and it's not even that you're playing bad, you just, you know, things are happening, and, and uh, um, yeah, and then Shane doing Shane things. Mike asks, how do you send appreciation for the great pool content? Collins will have his payment information up on the stream, you guys. You can send donations through there. Um, on the uh, post-up channel. Oh, ah, okay, okay. I don't okay. think I put the links on this one. Okay. Well, show some love. We're here all week, or longer than a week, actually, so... Um, goes yeah, a long way. You'll have plenty of opportunities to see it. Does the four go into the left middle? I think it probably does pass the five. We'll see here right after we shoot I the two it, ball. It may, but boy, it's even hard to get there, you know? So yeah. Shane's got a plan in mind. He used every inch of that pocket. I'm not sure that's where he wanted to be at Collins. I think he's going to get the, the rake out. There's a small gap there between the four and the eight, which would tell me that I think it does pass the eight, and it does indeed pass the five, if you can get there. Indeed. I don't think you can get there from here, though. That's real tough. I mean, draw the crap Mike out of Molly the ball. Mike says, thanks for the Moscone picture. She loved it. Oh, that's awesome, Mike. I'm, I'm glad she did. I forgot I even sent it out. They sent her a signed picture from Team USA. Nice. The guy's daughter. Yeah, it's pretty cool. He is drawing the crap out of it. Mm. Get around the tent. Mm. Does not. Okay, now what are you going to do? Does it go off the eight? Stop He's... it. <laughs> I, Stop I mean, it. Just look at it. Stop Does it go? It. It's close, It's man. close. It is close. It's really close. I mean, when you're up 7-1, why, you, why not you just know? fire I mean, it. the safe is hard, too. You know, There's so. no safe. I don't think there's a safe here. Well, you can play cue ball. I don't know if I mean, he called You can it. play cue ball. I don't know if he called it. I don't think he called it. Did he call it? Does it matter? I know he ain't playing it off the eight. Look at this shot. What are you doing here? Oh, next level. Masterclass what stuff here. What the hell is that? No. When in doubt, keep it simple. Wow. But did he leave a he cut left, in the side? I think he left a cut in the side. I think he pointed to the side. Just got a note, Shane has won the 10 ball in 2011, 2016, 2017, 2018. And in 2016 and 18, he won the eight ball as well. Shane has had a lot of, Shane just come over here and just rob these events. And there wouldn't be a yeah. lot of players here in years past. And, but this is certainly a very different field. And, um, but either way, he's very comfortable here. He always supported Mark Griffin's events. And it just shows why he is where he's at. 
in the tournament right now as Vitaly cuts the ball in the side and hits pretty good. Overran it by a little bit, but I think he's going to cut it again in the side. Well, the point can, can sneak out and is he banking this ball from putting bottom on it looks like it yeah. and he is little little love off the side of the eight ain't nothing wrong with that he needs it at this point he needs a little something to, nice to get down. the get the momentum going you know yep A lovely nudge, as uh, Carl Boys might say. I gotta work on my Carl Boys impressions. It's close. That's not. No, I could. I could do better. I gotta figure out some other phrases. Where's the cue ball going? Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. That's the snooker guy, mm -mm. isn't it? There's a snooker guy that says that. Who? I don't know the guy's names. I don't. I don't know the snooker scene. Well, either way, that was a great impression. Oh yeah, great. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dig no. Don't ever do that again. <laughs> don't ever do. That. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, Jim, what? <laughs> yeah, I gotta work on that one. What has he done here? It sounded like Arnold Schwarzenegger was Colin Snooker. Yeah. That's the first thought that came to mind. Yeah, okay. But it was close. You know. Yeah. You gotta shoot your shot. <laughs> Do my Pepsi impression. Oh, God. Oh, no. That guy. We need that guy in the booth. Vitaly, looking for the silver break. <laughs> <laughs> to send SVB into another dimension. Another dimension. <laughs> He's lost the plot. <laughs> Those are good ones, dude. That's uh, actually very good, buddy. Those are good ones. Those are epic. Good job, man. Oh man, I, I'm sorry, guys. I freaking love this game and everything about it and all those things. I love all those guys just because they add so much to the. You know, just the the stuff that you can talk about. On you the gotta side. have your own flavor, man. Yeah, it's you know, great. To each their own. It's great, dude. I like Pepsi. He does a great job. Yeah, Pepsi. It's funny. I love him for like, you know, three or four racks. Originality. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this break. Finally, Vitaly gets something going for him. This is about as good as it gets. You can't ask for nothing better. This is actually as good as it gets. Got two four railers down. I think Shane just shifted position in his chair because he just noticed. Wait, Vitaly found a break. Could get dangerous. He's got the eyebrow scrunch. If you were to just walk into the match and just see his face, would you think he's 7-2 up or 7-2 down? I think he's... I actually think he's dead even with that, that facial expression. Mm. He's dead even. Well, this is tic-tac-toe here for Vitaly. I can't unhear that Pepsi impression. Uh, yeah. Well, the thing yeah. I love about Pepsi and, and even Mark White, I mean, Mark White isn't, I mean, Mark, I like what Mark White does, right? But I love that he's, he's always so intense with everything he says, you know? Yeah. <laughs> it's great. It's good for the game. Personality. Indeed. Strong back here for five ball in the corner. He's yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's even, a, it's a perfect break. It is, yeah. I mean, that really was the yeah. that was the silver break. Oh, <laughs> whoa, 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 baby, easy there, cowboy. everybody, relax. Easy there, cowboy. Everybody, relax.
Everyone's like, do Batman. Do Captain Kirk. I honestly, I didn't watch much Star Trek. That's Star Trek, right? Captain Kirk. I've literally never watched an episode. No Calcutta for this event, guys. No. Finally, a breath of fresh air for Vitaly in this match. Shane just waiting his turn to... Checking the rolly. Yeah. See what time he's going to be able to go, to go to dinner tonight. Yeah. This is not I think it's the angle he wanted, but should be fine. Oof. Hit it really good, actually. He hit it fat so that the cue ball wouldn't move so much. Yeah. Yeah, he hit it like dead perfect. Look at his cue He's ball. He's perfect with the cue ball. Yeah, so he hit exactly the part of the pocket he was intending. Absolutely. All right. Seven to three. And let's see if the tides are going to turn any. Shane's halfway home to another U.S. Open 10-ball championship. He's shaking his head. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, he's thinking, how the hell do you break that good? Because that was a pretty good that break. Was, yeah. That was a perfect break. Yeah. Dude, Frank Caliendo and his... His uh, John Madden. Oh man, there's nothing better. That, that guy right there, he's he's got mud on his jersey. <laughs> Six ball down, cue ball dead center table, and look at that break, dude. Is anything gonna get tied up? Things it get a not. little bit. Things get a little close, you know, with the the two, three, and eight. You don't really have rails to work with very easily, negotiating your way through those balls, but. That being said, it's looking pretty juicy, this rack here. Yeah, it doesn't get, I mean. A couple of fantastic he's breaks. He's like, oh, yeah, you players. got the perfect break. I'll show you. Yeah, yeah. You got the perfect break. I'll break one that's almost as good. Yeah. Is post-up still live on 8-Ball? No, we're coming back after this match. I'm using all my equipment on this match. We'll be back right after this with the eight ball. You guys can check out the bracket for the U.S. Open eight ball championships on Digital Pool. Search U.S. Open eight ball. Okay, I know there's a lot of people getting annoyed with the impressions, but no, no, there's no, some no, people no, that no. there's some people that like it, and I think you guys will get a kick out of this one. The only Batman impression I can do, okay, is the uh, the Christian Bale Batman. Mm -hmm. Cause you just gotta sound like you're, you just gotta sound like you're really out of breath. <laughs> That's actually pretty and good. You were running up a hill so fast that you got to get back Dude. and sit down for just a second. That's pretty epic, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> You've been working on that one for a no, while. No, no, I actually get yeah. lightheaded every time well, I, I do tell. it. Yeah, you're a little glossy out after that. No, I'm, I'm actually like hyperventilating right now. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta relax though. We may have to yellow card you. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Chat's loving it though, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Chat's loving it. Oh man, Christian Bale's Batman, epic. Tell you if this pool streaming doesn't work out. <laughs> okay. We may have to, we may have to be your manager, buddy. Yeah, sure. We'll get you some gigs. Okay. <laughs> Look at that. To those people saying, can, a, you talk B, C, D. can you talk about the match? For those of you saying that, I mean, it's like when the balls break open like that, what is there to say? What is there to say? Go one rail to every ball. Just make a ball, go one rail, get straight in on the next shot. Do you yep. know what I mean? It's like yep. Shane's just going to make it look like they're all hangers. I don't think there's much to say. Can never please everybody. No, yeah. That's for sure. Because for every, for every person that's saying that, there's another person that's saying, good Lord, if you only talked about every shot, I'd fall asleep. Yeah. 
So try to find a good balance, guys. If you're new to the stream, that is. That's I'm just addressing those people. If you're new to this, that vibe, I know it's new to pool. Not for everybody. Imagine we see a third one in a row. Not trying to jinx it, but the last two breaks have been quite something special. Shane ain't even looking. All right, come on. Let's see this break. See if he can have a repeat of the last one. I'm not the one. Oh, right God. Here we go. Here we go. Whoa. Oh. Oh, baby. Almost gets a scratch in the side. Yeah, was but that from a kiss or was that his cue ball straight off no, the stack? No, no, no. I mean, he came across it a little bit compared to hitting it square like the last time, but he almost got kissed in there, kicked in there. And what do you do here? You got to go, right? You got to go. You got to go. You got to go. Yeah. I think you got to go. He's looking at banking it towards the four, I think. And putting the cue ball on the six, maybe. I think Vitaly, maybe with how the break has been turning out lately, it's, it's, it's understandable to be a little bit gun shy about going after it here. Um, but I think if you play that safe and and you don't get close enough to the six, Shane's just going to jump the ball and, and I just, slam listen, it in you, the hole. You got an opportunity, you got to take it, you know? And I get weighing out your options uh, there, but uh, yeah. I thought he, the cut was much more favorable. Yeah, but yeah, because you can just, you don't really have to worry about the cue ball. You're just going back like, and forth. Yeah, like 80% yeah. of the table is open, yeah. open season, you know what I mean? Right. thin i mean it's yeah but, but this he, is this is you know obviously easier oh Whoa! i was gonna it. say easier version of the last shot but yeah. uh forgot to make it vitaly patsura eat your heart out gotta be excited for this one And this is the break he needed. Big mountain to climb, but, you know, listen, you got to start somewhere, right? Uh, this is uh, actually... And it's on Vitaly's break, right? Th th this is kind of tough here. No, no, no. no. I, think he's all, I think he's fine. He come out one rail. Oh, my slammerino. Say Slammerino in your Batman voice. Oh, my stroke alicious. Okay, relax. relax. Oh, my puncheroni. He punched the hell out of that ball. Yeah, he hit it good. He hit it good. I like how the guy misses one ball and there's comments he's dumping the game. How does, I mean, <laughs> it's the got guy, to be sarcasm. The, the guy's it, not allowed to miss a ball? It has got to be sarcasm. Oh, dude. I, I, we we do have a sarcastic chat. You got to admit that we, we gotta, do. We got it. They're yeah. full of jokes. Yeah. Is Chris Swart in the chat? Chris Swart on YouTube. I don't think I've ever seen Chris on YouTube. Who's that? Chris Swart, the owner of uh, California Billiards. Oh, in nice. Fremont, California. Nice. I think we got to stop out there for the Lucasio tour. Pretty I sure. hope so. Pretty we sure should. we do. We Pretty should sure at some we point, do. Because that's a great room with I'm a like, lot of players. All right, big game here for Vitaly, and they're all going to be big from here on out. Shane breaking and running. I wonder if the pull stat guy is in the chat or 
I'm, Maybe somebody can I tell us know. how many breaking runs he's had. I don't know. I think he's now contracted with... Uh, no, he's just kidding. Oh, is he? Yeah. Oh. Speaking of sarcasm in the chat, Oblivion says, Collins has single-handedly ruined the goddamn stream. Oh, yeah. I, I know Oblivion. Congratulations. Well, Oblivion's my boy. Yeah? Yeah. Nice. Rolled question, that one up. Question from the chat says, is Vitaly a phoenix? Is he coming back from the dead? I think mm. that's what they're trying to say. 8-4. Huh? Shane. Step closer, that's for sure. Shane shaking the head. He can't believe he missed that one ball. I don't think anyone in the chat can either. What's the Lucasi tour? We are in combo about sponsorship. Hmm. We are in combo about sponsorship. Yeah, I'm not sure what that means. If you don't know what the if you don't know what it is, how are you in conversations with them? Doesn't make sense. Anyway, it's a West Coast tour that we're doing out in California, Arizona. I think Idaho, Vegas. We got eight stops in total. I think we got the first four planned out. I think I have dates on three. Do you? I have dates on three of them. Yeah. I should know it, but. The inaugural event is going to be in April at Hard Times Billiards in Sacramento, California. Next month is going to be a lot of traveling again. Yeah. Big break. Whoa, Eight ball down. Cue ball flying getting kicked. All over the place. He's going to have a shot, though. A it, shot. It's, it ain't a hanger. Three balls in a good spot, too, or an okay spot. Whoops, wrong button. Is there any Arizona stops? There is supposed to be one Arizona stop. That's for sure. <clears throat> That's all going to be streamed to you through post up, Indeed. covering the whole thing. If you want to know what's going on with West Coast Pool, that's the channel to follow. What's your page called again? I'm spacing on it, honestly. Nice shot from Shane, and it's going to get Jesus rewarded. Christ. You got to go, man. You yeah, got to go. He's a, he's a killer. You know, look when, look when, at the way he's when, walking around the table. like Stalking it, man. No, he's like walking like... Uh, like that's right, that one ball's going in. You know, like, just... Ugh. Do it in the Batman voice, just, though. Ugh, no, no, the Batman no. voice is worn out. I'll pass out. It'll make me pass out, I'm serious. <laughs> All right. Breathing too heavy. Breaking my heart, man. <laughs> All right. Can you fade running into the six here? Draw oh, out yeah, of it? Yeah, yeah, 100%. Yeah? Okay. 100%. I think you can get to the rail. Ah, uh, yeah, see, I he knew. He didn't even want to, though. No, he didn't, but he's fine. He controlled it very well. Uh, question in the chat about scores around the room. We can do uh, we can do a little a little score update after this match or this rack. Dude, Chris helped you out with the booth out in California Billiards. Yeah, Chris helped me set it up. Okay, yeah. good. Like helps me put it together. My yeah. back's injured, Chris, after oh, helping okay. Collins over here in Vegas. So you're you're gonna be I on load the up clock the panels out there. by myself. You guys can't even help me take them down. <laughs> yeah. You're a bad man. Gonna draw out of this one. Three balls away from a nine five nine four lead. Yeah, Tal Max Rec is the sponsor of this event. And um, I haven't heard any complaints from any players. No, they all at all. I haven't heard like one every single one that I've asked in the asked in the booth says, No, it seems to do its job well. Yeah. The balls are all tight. And you'll know like because players will about... complain about it like nonstop. Yeah. You know? Whoa, check this out. Ooh, okay. Got a little eh, sweater. He's fine though. Got a little sweater. Yeah, but he's fine. He's okay here. He just jinxed them, buddy. Congratulations. No, it's the it's the typical pool stream line. Or somebody gets out of line, it's like, oh yeah, but he's SVB. Nine to ten. Or sorry, nine to four. Yep. Any deals on town, special codes. If you're in the area, maybe if you stop by. Or unless Collins has you as a mod, we can talk about it. <laughs> I'll have some gloves and chalk and all that good stuff here probably tomorrow. 
I don't know why I haven't brought it to this point, but we'll have some stuff for Lazy. sale. That's just laziness. Sheer laziness. You're right, yeah. I haven't been doing anything with my days. I'm not saying I haven't been yeah. lazy. I just sit on a chair all day. Let's see watching. Wonder what Shane's thinking right now <laughs> with that face. Somebody <laughs> he's screenshot got the that. Same, he's got the same face every time. Someone screenshot that and make a meme. Came across it again. Six ball down, though. One ball is going to... Uh, he's, oh, he's fine. He'll have a, he's going to make the one, but he's got a lot of traffic to fade coming back and forth. Hey, Randy Stahl. Thank you, man, for the uh, cash app. And Jeffrey Machado, thank you for the uh, the beer later. I'll definitely be chucking that at a beer later. Are you going to buy me my coffee that they sent you money for? Or uh, that's on the, That was a super chat. I don't get that money until next month. So you're ah, <laughs> you might SOL. get it at the Lukasi. SOL then, huh? If I remember, ah. you might get it at the Lukasi. I know, what, I know what side I'm betting on. <laughs> <laughs> USA, Matt Wilson. Sh Shane is thinking about Vegas and the Mirage. <laughs> Oh, okay. Full pocket. All right. Cue but ball. it worked. The real nice side of the table. Just going to focus purely, purely on the pot. Shane ain't getting up for that two ball. No he's chance. He's saying, go ahead. <laughs> Shane's thinking, what? Yeah, Shane no is wondering if they kept his direct deposit info ready. <laughs> if you add the score together, it makes it equals me winning already. <laughs> is Shane playing in all the U.S. Open events? Yeah, yeah. I just confirmed that in uh, when he was in the booth. He says he's staying staying through. He's actually got a flight out of wow. Oh, bobbling the ball there, overcutting it, and cue ball rolling a little bit extra because of it. But anyway, Shane said that he's flying out of Vegas at midnight after the last day, and he plays in the PLP the next day. Pardon me, the next day. Like he lands the plane and heads over to the venue and goes to play he's, after checking into his hotel. He's a sicko like that. He's a sicko, dude. Nice shot there. I mean, Shane's, what, like 40 now, right? But he's still traveling consistently and playing top shelf, man. And listen, let me tell you, that new announcement of the million dollar... Oh, um, it's got him fired up. Uh, purse for the World yeah. Championships, the World Nine Ball? Yeah. That'll motivate Shane. Trust me, he was talking yeah. about it. He's not, he? he's not thinking about anything else. That's what he said. Basically. Yeah, yeah, he yeah. says, I'm just focusing on my rotation game, my rotation break, my nine ball break. Yep. And he said, uh, like, because... He likes his money. Because Federer was barking at him in the chat. Saying, when are we going to play a big game? And Tony was barking at him, too. And Tony was chirping at him as soon as he walked in the door this yeah, morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he says, uh, I'm just not focused on one pocket right now. It's the funniest thing, because if you go anywhere where Tony Chohan and Shane Van Boning are in the same building... Just hang out and wait till Tony gets a minute because he'll start needling Shane like no other. Yeah, it's it's hilarious. Hey, Chris Snyder, welcome. Better late than never, buddy. Just draw him back a little bit, hit that perfect. And he's doing all he can do, right? Just handle your business when you get a chance. And gotta hope that Shane makes a couple of mistakes. Ooh. Okay. This is the final match. One race to 13. U.S. Open 10 ball championship presented by Q Tech. Live from Griffs in Las Vegas, Nevada.
Yo, what's up, Stebs Duarte? Saketh K says, this guy got game. He certainly does. I mean, he's made it to the final. Did you guys see the field in this tournament? Just go look at the bracket. It's it's ridiculous. Hey, Lindy Russell says, I sent beer money to Mike and Collins. Collins will take care of that beer money. Yeah. Yeah, you will. Mike will pass <laughs> pass on it, but maybe I'll use it for coffee for him. Lindy it, Russell, thank you so considering much. Considering I don't drink. Yeah. Yeah. But we appreciate the support, for sure. Yeah, that's coffee money for Mike. Thank you. That I'll see. Mike maybe, gave I'll, up the alcohol and just I'll swapped see, over to caffeine. He drinks it, more caffeine than he ever did booze. Maybe I'll see that coffee at the 2025 U.S. Open 10 ball. Oh, look at this. If you're lucky. If I'm lucky. I don't think he's got a shot here, yeah, buddy. Yeah, he's got a shot. He's, it's, he can see the one. It's not easy. But you know what? You just got to bear down. That's all you got to do. It's really got to bear Could down Could this here. be the beginning of the turning of the tide? I think it goes. I'm pretty sure it goes. Well, either way, even if it goes, it's not the easiest shot. What about the rail first? Golly, you know how tough that is that far away? The rail first, the slide across the table. That is so tough to do. There's no, You can't make that ball rail first. Oh, he was trying to go for it. Leaves a little bit of inside. And Vitaly's going to have to come with one here. Can you give me the overhead, buddy? <clears throat> Please? Hmm. Let's get a score update. Some matches for the U.S. Oh, yeah, Open that's right. Yeah, yeah. As Vitaly is sizing up this one ball. Dude, I love this funky, funky wah pedal music. Bader Alawadi is uh, already jumping. through. He's going airborne. Has finished two matches already. Vitaly does not have to win two sets. This is a single extended race to 13. Oh, and he almost made it, and he's going to sell out. I, oh, that's unfortunate. He came so close. Solid effort. Mario He currently up 7-1 to one versus Max Eberly. We got to get that guy in the booth. Yeah. Max Everly had a bye in the in the tournament, and now down seven to one. Carlo Biato finishes his match eight to zero. Oh, he was playing a probably a local player, Marco Scabin of four thirty Fargo. So somebody just firing, hanging out with the pros, yeah. schmoozing with the pros. And uh, Joshua Filler, Billy Thorpe right now on table 13 on that uh, Windows Open table. Score is currently 6-4 to four in favor of Josh Filler. Nice shot here. Perfect angle to come out for the five ball. Victor Zelinsky uh, defeated Daniel uh, Machiao. Oh, man. First round. That was an interesting first round matchup. John Morris slated to play uh, John Salim after defeating Skylar Woodward 8-4 to four in the first round. How do you like showing up to Griff's and losing your first match as Skylar Woodward? 
Tony Chohan up four to one versus Savannah Easton. Lee Van Corteza dispatches Corey Duell in fifty three minutes, beating him eight to zero. Is it nine five or ten five? It is now ten five. Okay. What's that? Nothing. I clicked on I clicked on my stream, mm. and I thought it had ended. You know what I mean? I thought we weren't live. We're good. Taking his time here with the rack. He's running out of time, though, in the match. Shane's just a runaway train right now. Nice. That's the break that got him here. Hey, did my YouTube chat break? I'm not seeing any comments coming through. It's been that way for a while, I think. There we go. I fixed it. I fixed it. YouTube chat was frozen for a minute there, guys. That's why we weren't really interacting. We didn't. Oh, he wanted to put that right behind the eight ball. I love the idea. Not the execution that he wanted, but it's a great attempt. What happened? Your, the chat? Yeah, the chat was just frozen, so we, ah. we fixed it now. try <laughs> look at his face he's like really that ball didn't go in like it was a hanger <laughs> little drag shot here nice full hit just making sure he stays on the three ball. Only issue is the seven ball, Collins. It's the only thing I'm really seeing getting in the way. With where the five is in relationship to the six, I think uh, it should be fairly manageable to get some type of angle like, uh, like this on the six to play the basically the wagon wheel. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Was he trying to bump the seven there? There's no way. Right? Huh. This is thin, so he's really wants to make sure he hits it how he's intending to. 
Chat saying that Ronnie O'Sullivan just made the 167 break. Did he? Oh, epic. 000. Wow. Thought who, it was like half a million. Who else would do it? Like that fast. You know what I mean? Who would, Who else would it's be like the, the first guy? first event. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, who else would be the guy that would do it first well, event? Well, I know in Stuttgart they were saying the pockets have been playing a little more loose in the last few years, you know? So that was definitely doable, but yeah, it, it's perfect that it's Ronnie, though. Speaking of perfect, look how Vitaly just drew that shot. Straight out of the jaws of the pocket, didn't even touch a rail. He's perfect on the five. I believe he's queuing low to get that angle that I was talking about earlier. Not going to get there. Maybe forward two rails? No idea. One no idea how you play this. 147 or 167? 167. The 167 is the half a million, I think. They're saying 147 in the chat, so... I don't know. Okay. Seven nine. I guess. Got to get straight and fairly close. Got a lot of angle this here, probably man. Probably won't do it. The internet did not tell the truth. Yeah, I know what. Yeah, we. Yeah, the 147 is the maximum, but they introduced a new yellow ball for a 167. I think it was half a million. Yeah, that's what I heard. Yeah, that's so, why I was so surprised to hear it had happened already. Yeah, it was the very first. So apparently, event. it hasn't happened already. Right. <laughs> yeah. Is what are he you going here? What? Paying the carom? Combo. Okay. Oh my gosh. The tally Patsura. He wants to bounce. Going for the jugular. I mean, what are you gonna do, right? You have to shoot that ball. And that was hard. Yeah. That was a funny angle, man. That was not that was like You couldn't pay me to be excited to shoot that shot. <laughs> well, I mean, I could come up with a number, but Yeah. Right on, Chris Knowles. Thanks for hanging out, buddy. Thanks for helping. Where's that cue ball going? Holy crap, it was going right at the side pocket and he's on the 50 yard line. <laughs> what? What are you laughing at? Nah, nothing. What? Nothing. Look outside pocket. Look no. outside pocket. Oh! oh my god. All he can do is laugh. Wow. Set a timer. I say 40 seconds. Playing with fire there, but you got to take uh, swings. 10 6 now, right? Yep. Right? Okay. 10 6 now. Can, sh can Shane. <laughs> <Don't. Oops. laughs> Sorry, that was Collins dropping his phone trying to adjust those short shorts he's got. <laughs> Not short. No, they're short, buddy. No, they're, they're not. short. If you'd like to see how short they are, just go check out Windows Open. Oh, oh look at that. Okay. 
All right, it ain't over yet. Just because I don't wear my shorts like Tony Chohan. I mean, look, I'm not saying you got to wear them like Tony. I just think there's a middle ground to be <laughs> had where you're leaving something for the imagination, buddy. All right, that's all I'm saying. But well, we love you, buddy. Thanks, man. Yeah. I tell you who doesn't love something. And that's this one ball right here for Shane. I have no idea. There's not even really a place to push out to. Because you're just pushing out to an easy safe. Everywhere you go. love the chat is he gonna get is he gonna get he away with course. it wow no, he hit it perfect he hit it great this is intentional. yeah 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 no, no no that's what i meant to say excuse me this is intentional nice shot <laughs> i'm gonna consider this situation that you guys are talking about in the chat as a victory. Because, no, a victory for me. Ah, okay. Mike would have been much better off not mentioning it to me and me just wondering what's going on in the chat. But he showed me right away. He was so proud that he I couldn't stop laughing. That's the problem. And Collins knows me too well. And he's immediately just like, you know, suspicious, you know, right away. Listen, it's your booth. You you be as comfortable as you want in your booth. I'm a, I'm in your house. Oh, I'm comfortable. I, I, we know. We know. He can't see the one. Can no, you show? He can't. No, he can't see. The wow, one. I thought he could see the one. No, look. Oh, if that well overhead was a little. No chance. He almost made a jump earlier, and he was real close. That one did not threaten. He needs that ball to slow up, and it is not. Y'all send Colin some money so he can buy some the rest of the fabric for... Oh, yeah. <laughs> for his Let him have it. You are unforgivable. Ugh. Okay, you know what? That's it. The, I'm taking it off. A of window's open. Don't take it off. No, I take it off. I'm, I took it off. No, it's a, it was. They got. They got the best. Fans. Yeah. Fans were cheated to the best five minutes of their life thanks to those shorts, buddy. Well, I'll tell you yeah. what. You, you you deleting that post actually. You just sacrificed. You know, probably about a hundred thousand likes because those are some good. Listen, we're thoughts. not. They, so. <laughs> you don't got. You don't got to tell me. It's been hard to stay concentrated over here. <laughs> <laughs> you got to me. All right, SVB. He smells blood. He's looking at the finish line. Yeah. <laughs> Can't think about it. Oh man. I took down the post, so it's no longer on windows open. If you got to see it, you got to see it. Congratulations. <laughs> Tip Collins on your way out. Yeah. I got to go to table 11. All right, buddy. Okay. Thanks for that, Mike. Speaking of 11, Mike is on his way to table number 11. Shane Van Boning on his way. And arrived with game number 11. Oh, I guess the race length in the tablet was not set to 13. It might have been set to 11 on accident. Looks like Shane's going to go check it out with Brandon Birch. Where they at? Where they at? 
can't really see. I know it's blurry, guys. The trouble has, or sorry, the camera has trouble focusing when it's dark out. Tally. More trouble on the break here. More trouble on the break with three with the three ball. Did Shane make the ten? The ten ball? Or whatever it was? Eleven six. Okay. Sorry, my phone was just blowing up, dude. <coughs> Those thighs are just popular, son. I mean you know that. Well, yeah. Mike, there was a guy in the chat trying to get a hold of someone from Derby about a contest he won. Yeah, I'm not sure. Tell him to, if it's a contest I did, then tell him to hit me up. I don't think, I don't know. Have him send me a message. We'll be glad to, if I can help out, I will. Heather Cook. Heather Cook, where the hell did you find that yeah. emoji? <laughs> it's, very, it's very fitting. Uh, Those shorts don't fit, but. That's oh, they fit great. Yeah, nice, nice. Yeah, nice. hit that ball they thin. Hit, hit that ball thin. What do you like here, buddy? Like that? Yep. Okay. He's trying to make the ball here. Yeah, he's going after a kick. The way he was aiming this mirror system, I think he went past the one ball so that he could account for the slide, I think. Because this is going to go long. So he was aiming short. Because if he actually hits it short, the cue ball, the cue ball can scratch. But if it goes long, mm, oh wow, he wasn't off by much. Didn't aim short enough, but hell of a try. Michael Thomas coming in with the PayPal for additional material for those shorts. <laughs> <laughs> oh man uh, golly we need some fabric man yeah does anybody know a seamstress Hmm. 
can we petition for a knee cam? May have to char right. charge by the minute for that. <clears throat> but depending on the price, we might be able to make it happen. After all, we are are in Vegas. Do you know Hua Beats? No idea, but he keeps on typing that in like 18 times now. Yeah, $1,000 cash game, me and Melina Mike. It's kind of tough to agree to a match with somebody that you've never met before, Hua. I know so you hang out in the chat a lot, but we, we don't know who you are. Sounds like I've been asking for a game with him by the way he's commenting, but... Yeah. <clears throat> Only fan. Okay. <laughs> the chat has gone full chat mode. <laughs> it just, it just. I want to get. Listen, I'm trying to get them the like the jokes. the Griffin the the Griff's experience, you know. <laughs> so. Oh no. Yeah, I'm not in Sacramento, buddy. What are you doing here? I don't know why he's taking so long here. I mean, a lot of good things can happen no matter where the cue ball is. So uh, just trying to make make use of this combo, make it a little bit more controllable, I guess. He's really going to – I bet you he's going to slow roll this, like, super, super, super slow. Like, just enough to get the five in the hole. Are you playing to make the nine in the five? Like, uh -oh. that, might the nine ball go into the five? No, because then you lose the cue ball. But if you just play it fat – no, you don't lose the cue ball because you can come off the rail and come back out. I don't think you lose the cue but ball. But it's really all. it's really thin to get the four to go there, I think. And the cue ball's going towards where the nine is. Okay. But if you just roll this real slow, the four should stay right there. He played the four off the nine. Damn, okay. Yeah, real nice shot. Yeah. I like the pure draw shot here. When you're close to the ball like this. Just a pure draw shot. Just get out the stroke cam. All right, I think all the hard work has been done. Later, Alan Keeney. If you like the event and appreciate the free stream, make sure and hit the subscribe button to Griff's. We cannot do it without them. We would we wouldn't be here without them. Right. So. Well, well, well. Ooh. Well, well, well. With where the ten is sitting, all of a sudden this shot gets real interesting. Yeah. Do you let the stroke out and, and pull the cue ball away from the 10 and go around the table since the 9 is in the uh, corner, maybe? Or do you just run into the 10 because the 9's in the corner? I think <laughs> I think you just run into the 10. If you hit the right, the top side of the 10 as we're looking at it, there's a scratch. Yeah, I think you just... I wouldn't want to let it go. That's just me. But look at the scratch. Look the at scratch the scratch. Look at the, the scratch. Oh. Side. Ay, 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 the frustration, the understandable frustration of the SVB-ness that's about to be unleashed. All right, I'm going to step on out of here, buddy. It's been fun hanging out with you. Where are you going? I got to do some work, man. Okay, yeah. You know? I'll just sit here and not work. Listen, by the length of those shorts, you're working, buddy, is what it sounds like to me or looks like to me. Shane Van Boning right. on the hill of the U.S. Open 10-Ball Championship. Well, let me see after this break. Yeah, why would you leave right now? Well, because I want to get I want to get a video. I want to I'm going to talk to the guys. You got to get trophies done. I got a lot of stuff to do. Well, how do you know? That's why I said we'll see after the break. Okay. All right. I'll play Collins for a thousand, but he has to wear those shorts. <laughs> you get your money's worth right there.
four yeah, ball. Four ball. One ball coming up. That's how many balls? Game set and match. It's three ball. How, how many balls do you need to make on the break, dude? Yeah, you're right. He'll probably be done in about a minute and a half. Oh my god, Shane Van Boning fallen for the fallen for the Molina Mike curse. No way, dude. No way. Too much pressure trying to win his first big tournament. Yeah, exactly. If I'm Vitaly and I didn't think I was coming back to the table, I'm dogging this ball every time. Vitaly will probably not, but if, if it's me, the pressure. The pressure. What has he done there? <laughs> we need. Whoa, 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 whoa. Flirting with the corner pocket. Guys, we got drama. Kevin Clark coming in with the PayPal's. If you know, you know. Thank you, man. The man, the myth, the Clark. The Kevin Clark, better. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Vitaly Petsura. Vitaly Petsura staying alive. Staying alive. Oh, thank you, to Tobias Georgie, for the appropriate quotation marks around who is this commentator. Quote, commentator, because I respect that. I'm technically not a commentator. I just hang out with you guys. It's like a, I treat it more like a video game stream or like we're hanging out on the rail. Thanks for acknowledging it. My name's Collins. Collins knew he, I was hanging out with Molina Mike in the second chair for a while there, but he had to step out because he was certain that the match was over. That'll teach him. Nice, Vitaly. Now do that five more times. That only gets him to the hill, Edie. <laughs> All right.
Six ball down. One ball gets kissed to the short rail. Two ball down. Four ball down. There's only six balls on the table. But he's got to chop the one real thin. Ooh. Yo, 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 yo. He's got to cut the one ball thin and avoid all this. And do that. I don't know, dude. I don't know, dude. He was just looking from this end of the table so that he could see that line that he's got to follow after cutting this one ball in. <clears throat> and he runs into the nine. And Shane Van Boning now separated from the title of U.S. Open champion by only six balls. Yeah, that shot was always going to be a tall order, guys. That shot was always going to be a tough one. Perfect angle on the three. With this angle on the three ball, you can access, access any point on the table with the cue ball. Look at this cue ball. Look at the speed. Shane Van Boning walking around the table like the champion he is. And Vitali is going to have to settle for runner-up. As we give the trophy to Shane Van Boning, your 2024 U.S. Open 10-ball champion. What a tournament from both players. Congratulations. Let me turn the room mic up a bit. That's pretty good. Congratulations, Shane Van Boning. This is Mike working, by the way, guys. That's Mike doing the work. And Shane just wants to hit more balls. Shane wins a championship and just goes and practices. Immediately starts to practice. <laughs> Runner-up trophy. Nice crystal trophies. They look real nice. Brandon bringing in the champion trophy. All these pictures and post-match interviews can be found on Windows Open, guys. Should probably give a huge shout-out to our sponsors. Uh, this is only the first tournament. This is only the first tournament of four. We got three more to go. U.S. Open 8-Ball, U.S. Open Banks, U.S. Open 1-Pocket. Shout-out to the sponsors. 1PKT, Michelle Griffin, Realtor. Fast and Loose Designs, Premier Billiards. The Town Max Rack. Diamond Billiard Products and our title sponsor. Thank you so much to Q-Tech. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What a great event so far. Shane Van Boning takes first place at $9,000. I am going to go live again on post up, guys. I'm going to get that stream set up while they do the celebrations. You guys can check it out.
<laughs> you gotta get in. Hold on, let me take a couple guys. Nice, 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 dude. Up next on the stream table. I don't think Shane's going anywhere. I actually think on the stream table we've got more SVB in the 8-ball. I think we got more SVB in the 8-ball coming up. You can catch this interview on Windows Open if you want to see what Shane has to say. Alban Ocean coming out. Getting ready to hit some balls. Chat box coming back, guys. The chat box from post up. Coming back. Let's go. Boom. What's up, one for yo? Wombra says that was highlight of the tournament for me. What was that, Wombra? <laughs> <laughs> 